So it turns out the Yol of Londor, by drawing out our true strength, tore a hole in out of us, and now we just have this pussy black darkness oozing out of us. And it's his accumulating curse. So, uh, that's great, isn't it? Um, how much does it cost to get rid of it? Because I'd kind of like to get rid of it. I mean, I don't know that it actually doesn't. I think that's really expensive. That is more than a level. Okay. So I guess we're going to go and... Oh, let's burn the undead bone shard. Because that gives us better Esther's flask. Um, and... Let's continue with our journey onwards. We were going to go and check out what was down below the, um... Undead Church, because as I said, we've went down the la the we went up, sorry, and found Siegvard and the Fire Demon, but we found very little else. Oh, this Fire Katana! My word! I forgot that I'd even upgraded that, and I'm appreciating it greatly. <laughs> Ow! Oh, I have my. I should probably change that. So that I have my shield equipped. Let's chug us an Estus. Lovely. And up we go. Right, who's out here today? Let's see how difficult it is to... Oh, one hitting these. Lovely. Don't mind if I... Am I... No, he's still alive. I'll have to try and keep that in mind. Just looked like he was dead. Right. You know what? I'm just going to gun it through them again. Because... Let's not even bother dealing with them. Hello, Lutrec. How are you today? I mean, I don't actually know your real name, but because you're quoting Lutrec, I'm just going to call you Lutrec. Right. Down this time. Down, 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 down. Down, down, down. Down, down. Anything down here? This... Look suspect. This looks very suspect. Um, please no boss. I mean, we just fought one the other day. You are not a boss, but you look scary. Oh, you're like Vort, but mini. Thankfully, you're not too big a deal. Especially with our new fire katana. An Irithyll straight sword. Let's have a look at that. Uh, Irithyll, Irithyll, Irithyll. Straight sword bestowed upon the Outrider Knights of the Boreal Valley. This weapon is enshrouded in frost and causes frostbite. Ooh. I think we should give that a go, because that looks really cool. Actually, really good as well. Like considering it hasn't been upgraded at all, that's pretty nifty. Right, what's through here then? <laughs> oh, that's quite heavy. Right, we've got a bonfire. Hey. Now, don't know about you, but the road of sacrifices does not sound like a nice place. Okay, we can almost heal. Dark Sigil, and I want to go and heal that as soon as I fucking can, to be honest. What the fuck?! Oh! Uh. Okay! That's... You turned into a crow monster with talons and wings and shit. I mean, I don't know why I'm surprised at this point, because that's probably par for the course, but... Jesus. Okay. No, no, no! Okay, we're fine. A shriving stone? What's that? Um. No. That one. Uh, well, it's not in there. It's a key item. No, it's not. It's a. Okay, that's um, Undo's weapon infusion. So if we ever want to have a not fire katana, we can do that. That's pretty nifty. Time for a plunging attack. From where? From here. Something I can always appreciate. Just... 
I love the sound design in that. Did you just hear that crunching, mulchy bone? Just. Is that another? One? Ooh, great. Corvi and Scythe. I'll have to keep that in mind. Corvus means crow, right? In Latin? I think it's that. I mean, it would make sense given their design, wouldn't it? I am greatly appreciating how um, our weapon is upgraded at this point. Um, I can, I can hear someone breathing. I can't see them. And that's really not my favourite way to be able to see people, to be able to notice people. Range battle. Well, I guess we're meant to be able to shoot them, but oh, actually no, I think I did get a longbow at some point. I got a crossbow. Well, fuck off. Am I using that? Right, down we go and hope we don't get ambushed. Don't think I can't see you up there. Please no. You know, crows are more scared of you than you are of them. Especially if you're Grizzel. <gasps> you're really tough. Oh, you're a person. We found Pantsman 2.0. Old Pants Lady. Ow. You were no pants, man, you pathetic sack of shit. Right, see you in a bit. Right, let's claim our spoils. The butcher's knife. Lovely. And brigand armor. Nifty. Right, well, that's that was the, the pants imposter taken care of. Brigand twin daggers. Ooh, that sounds pretty cool. I might give them a go in a second. Liar ahead. Well, I don't particularly want to fall off this thing, especially considering it proved so lethal to uh, Miss What's Her Face. Up sweet goes. Um, there are some things up there that I don't particularly want to deal with. So I'm going to go up here and fight them, because that's the only way to do sensible. Yeah! It's fine. I also said. Titanite Shard! Yay! Only need one more and we can get up to plus three for our katana. Which is something I deeply, deeply appreciate. I think. Let's. Make sure we're on full health because I don't like the look of that guy over there on the hill. I reckon we can kill him. Yep, you know what? Fuck it. Let's go kill the guy on the hill first, because I don't like the look of him. Ow! No! Fuck. Well, that was f Hmm. Heard something strange. That guy dead, that's that guy dead, that's that guy dead, good. Oh, there's an item there. I'll go for that item. Soul of an unknown traveller. A lovely bit of cash in hand. Their faces are proper scary. Ow, 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 ow. Ugh. I'll say it again. These things are horrifying. Like, really, really horrifying. Okay, they just seem to be leave staying over there, so I'm going to leave them to their business as I run down here and have a look-see for my souls. Give me my souls! I'm going to cut him up first. And then... Leg it down here. Grab the item. Ember. Nice. Um, no one is, else is up here. 
Uh, I don't know what that beeping was. I think it was a Facebook message of some description. Now, okay, that's another dead thing. I'm going to go th Ow. Alright, let's go through there. And... Oh, Jesus. Oh, bonfire. Perfect. Perfect. Oh, that's majestic. Who are you two? You seem to be friendly chaps. You also seem to be Voldo. Oh, hello. How do you do? I'm Anri of Astora. That would be you, then. Would like you. This is Horace, a friend and travelling companion. Good evening, Horace! Are you two in search of the Lords of Cinder? We're well along the road of sacrifices. Below us is the Crucifixion Crucifixion Woods. woods. Who names this Anish, shit? Home of the Undead Legion. Further yet is the Cathedral of the Deep. We seek the Cathedral, home of the grim Aldrich. Aldrich! We may go our separate ways now, but we are both seekers of lords. I really like your voice. You and sound... Cross paths. You and sound yes. positively erotic! May the flames guide your way. But yeah, he's oh, yes. reminds me of um Oscar. He's not very talkative, but don't think ill of him. Who is the he first NPC you meet in the Dark Souls series? A fine partner for this grueling journey. That's good. Without his help, I would have cursed this onerous duty long ago. Why do I get the impression that you're going to betray him? We are well along beyond. We may the next time. May the okay. Well, see you later, Henri. Horace. <laughs> You are literally Voldo. Okay, good to hear. Right, let's light this bonfire. And I will see you guys next time. Ciao.